imagine that we've journeyed back in time to a century long since past. Greek mythology often tells us wondrous tales, not the least of which is that of Arian, a young poet who was cast into the deep sea only to be rescued by dolphins. Legends like this firmly establish just how long people have been enchanted by the dolphin. And if Arian were around today to tell us what it was all about, we can only imagine that his rescue must have looked something like this. Now while our trainers might not be Greek mythical heroes, they sure are people who love spending time in the water with their dolphin friends. Now while we're talking about the past, let's reflect close to home. Indigenous Australian histories and stories of the Dreamtime have long links to both the land and the sea. We know of stories recounting how dolphins would slap their powerful tails hard upon the water's surface, draw a fish into a tight corner, ready for fishermen's nets, while at the same time, of course, satisfying their own hunger. Off the vast Australian coastline, hundreds of years into our past, dolphins were already sparking 